Hey, it's Chris, and I've been waiting for Craftsman to come out with their own line of knives for quite some time, and they finally have in droves. There's so many out right now. They've got utility knives like this one with the single blade, ones that break off, and they've got a couple of different pocket knives that I'm gonna show you as well, including this one with the spring assist. So let's dig in. All right, here's the knives we're gonna be looking at today from Craftsman. These three are snap-off blade knives in 9, 18, and 25 millimeter. These are the three different sizes that they have. These two guys are utility knives. They have a whole bunch of utility knives out there. I don't have them all, this is just two. This is the one I use all the time, my daily driver, I guess you could call it. Um, so we're gonna go over those as well. And then these two guys, I'm most excited about these. These are pocket knives. They've got the spring assisted version and the ball bearing version. We're gonna take a close look at those as well. Now, like I said before, these are the three different sizes of snap off blade knives that they have, nine, 18, and 25 millimeter. So I'm gonna take all of these out of their packaging right now so you can kind of compare the difference. Okay, here are the three sizes side by side so you can see how they look in hand. This is the little guy. There's the 18 millimeter. And finally the 25 millimeter. Now the way these work is you just turn the little wheel now when you want to snap off and replace the blade, just leave it right around there. Take some pliers, or you can stick it in something like some wood or whatever, and you just snap it off like that. And you toss that out, and you've got a fresh blade. So that's how all three of these work. Got the same wheel that you rotate in order to get the blade out. Now the thing I really like about these snap-off blade knives is the look and the ergonomics and the feel. This kind of got a rubbery grip on here so it stays in your hand when you're using it. And just the fact that once you're done, you don't have to take out a blade and put another one in, you just snap it off. Now like I said before, Craftsman's come out with a ton of utility knives. This is just two, there's probably another six to 10 or a dozen more, there are a lot. Now the big difference between these two is this one on the left is really light. This is the one I use every day. This one over here on the right is a little bit heavier. It's built like a tank. So let me show you both of these real quick. Now both of these are retractable utility knives, which means you can slide the blade out right here on the top. And they both have this open part of the blade right here so that you can cut string. And they both have blade storage. The blades for this one are right here below the grip. In this one, you have to turn this to open it up. This swings open. There's the blade that you're currently using. These are the replacement blades that they put in the back. Now on this lighter one, the blades are underneath the handle. So what you wanna do is press on this tab that's on the back of the top. And then this, this door opens up to reveal the blades. And to close it back up, just push it back up inside. Replacing the blades on this one is really easy. There's a tab right here in the front, pops out, put a new blade in, press that tab again, it locks it into place. To replace the blade on the heavier one, it's a little bit more work, and I think that's by design, because on this one, it's fairly easy if you wanted to accidentally press that button and have it fall out. I've never done it personally, but on this one, there's absolutely no way to accidentally get that blade out. So what you have to do is you have to open it all the way up, twist it, and then you can replace the blade. Now when it comes to how it feels in your hand, well, both are pretty comfortable. This one's got the grip, but this one's also a little bit lighter, so there's more risk of that one flying out of your hand when you're using it. Just like the snap-off blade knives, Craftsman also makes replacement razor blades for the utility knives in various sizes. This one's the 75 piece. And now we have the two new Craftsman pocket knives, which I am most excited about because I'm a pocket knife guy. Now, the interesting thing about this is the current price for these at the time of producing this is $11 versus $17. These are inexpensive knives. They've got a stainless steel blade, a little bit of serration. The big difference between these two is this one's the ball bearing. This one's got the spring assist. So let's break them out of the packages and take a closer look at both of these knives. Well, here they both are out of their packaging. The one on the left is the ball bearing one. This is just the folding pocket knife. The one on your right is the spring assist pocket knife. And you'll notice that this one has what they call a bimaterial comfort grip. It's just a little bit of a rubberized material on there. This one's a little bit slippier. Uh, if you're wearing gloves, it's probably not gonna be that big of a difference. So here they are side by side. You can tell that they're both the exact same length and the blade length looks to be just under three and a half inches 
on both of these. Yep, three and a half. Now what's interesting is that the folding pocket knife has thumb studs right here. The spring assist does not, but both of them have liner locks, which is this piece of metal in here. Uh, you just have to push that to the side. It unlocks the blade so that you could fold it back up. And both of them have a notch on the back. This one's a little bit different design, but the same purpose. Unlock it. Now the spring assist does have a lock. The default is locked, so you gotta pull that down in order to unlock it. And then you use the notch on the back to open it up. As you can see, both have the exact same belt clip on the side. You can use a Torx bit to remove it, but you cannot put it on the other side and have it point the other direction. And both have this metal clip at the end so that you can attach it to something. So here's a cool thing that Craftsman offers on all of these, whether it's the snap-off blade, the utility knife, or the pocket knives, is they offer a full lifetime warranty on all of these knives. So if you ever have any issues with them, just call the 800 number and they'll take good care of you. Well, I'm sorry I couldn't show you all the new knives that Craftsman makes. It's just that there's so many of them and I just wanted to give you an idea of what's out there. Now, the one I use on a regular basis every single day without fail is this utility knife. I absolutely love it. Now, a knife that I carry with me on my person every single day and I have for years is just a pocket knife. And so I was really interested in checking out Craftsman's new pocket knives to see what they had to offer. And I I gotta say, I'm really impressed, especially for the price point. Now, if you're interested in carrying one of these around with you in your pocket every single day as your EDC, everyday carry, please be sure to check your state and local laws. The laws for what you can carry as a concealed knife vary from state to state and from city to city. In fact, the laws are different from Los Angeles to here in San Diego. So I don't want you to get in trouble. The concern with these is the blade length, which is over three inches, and this one that has a spring assist. So just be sure to check those out. I'll have some links in the description to some laws that you can check out as well as the products. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you next week for another one.